Hey guys, what's up? Megan here. Answering the questions on the last video about the whole gluten-free thing. Uh, one question I got was, uh, what t what gluten-free uh, carbs can you use, especially post-workout, you know, for recovery? Because it's really hard. I struggle with that thing. By the way, um, today's the third day. Like I told you guys, it's always on the, when I stop eating gluten by the third day, um, my nipples go back to normal. Yeah. See? See? Don't look like I got puffy nipples anymore, right? If you guys see my other videos, they they get really puffy. Some days they get so puffy, I don't even show y'all the videos. But um, but yeah, man, it works. Every time I cut up gluten, my nipples go back to normal for forever. And then when I re the problem is when I reintroduce gluten, even just a tiny bit, pff, my nipples just flare up. Um, by the way, me and Matt ate Wendy's the other day, and it was crazy. Woke up the next morning looking sick. Puffy ass nipple, like parachutes. All right. I made a little list for y'all. All right, for people that are not, for people in general, right? There's a lot of carbs out there that don't have gluten in them. They're actually good. You have potatoes, sweet potatoes, anything that's pretty much, like I said, complex carbs from the earth, natural, as close to the natural state as possible, going to be good for you. You got potatoes, you got sweet potatoes, you got oatmeal, brown rice, white rice, you got plantains, you got corn, you got sweet peas. So you could just rotate those foods into your diet. Don't think everything, the only thing that has gluten is wheat and pasta and stuff like that. Things that have gluten in them. Um, a lot of candy, a lot of junk food. Now, for people doing car back loading, which is my problem, I'm doing car back loading. And it's really, really hard to get that insulin spike with complex carbs, right? So before I used to use, you know, fast digesting carbs that I can't use anymore. I can't even use pizza, or breads, or cheesecake, or whatever. That cheesecake is horrible, by the way. But, um,. So now the only thing that you can use if you're doing carb backloading is, uh, I heard Kiefer mention ripe plantains, right? You can use ripe plantains. They, you know, even though it's a complex carb, it spikes the shit out of your insulin. Corn and white rice. Like, like I said, those are not ideal, but it's, like I said, if you can't eat gluten, which is like a 99.9% .9 of stuff, you can use these to uh, to backload, right? So once again, potatoes, sweet potatoes, oatmeal, rice, brown rice, plantains, corn, sweet peas. I have the list here because when I go shopping. I don't know what you get. So I hope that answers your question and let's look at the next one.